take a plane to Italy and go see it or something oh, like that? Of course. Uh, it will be in the theater uh, April 11th. Pacific. But I think in the website they can find everything. Just uh, put uh, uh, midway and uh, everything comes out. All right, sounds good. Ladies and gentlemen, keeping with the theme of an Italian show, uh, we're going to play another Pavarotti song from their albums, The Three Tenors. Uh, you want to tell us what this song's about? It's track 16, Antonella. What's this song about? The title is, original title in Italy is O Sole Mio. That means my sunshine. You will are my sunshine. Oh, I like that. Uh, and, uh, nothing like a little sunshine late in the dark <laughs> at night when she's had too much to drink. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here comes uh, Sydney. You got the button ready yeah. to go on this puppy here? All right, ladies and gentlemen, here is Luciano Pavarotti and Friends. Can I ask about Italian men? Uh-huh. We ask doing okay? Yeah. What? Yeah. I want to ask about the food or the men. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, it's it, playing a solo meal here. You're playing a song? Uh, and uh, Daz is doing some things. Did your, what did your friend think of our little routine? It was okay? Or he was great. You saw He's in here with us now. Huh? He's in here. He's not even busy to see Okay, sounds good. I'll tell him to upload to the Wild Bill site. Oh, <laughs> nice. That's good idea. Got... Oh, yeah. Take oh, that's a picture. beautiful she song. Got, she, got, she got a good picture, actually, already. How much time we got? That clock, we got about six the minutes? Like yeah. What would that clock say? All right, then what we're going to do, uh, I got an idea. We'll, we'll bring this down. We'll hit pause. And then we'll do some more banter. And then we'll close out the show with it and fade it out. Mm -hmm. We've got about ten minutes. Okay. Okay. You hearing this? Yeah. It sounds beautiful. That's the big dude, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he died. Yeah. 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 No, he died. Yeah. And Barry White died, you know. I... Recently, actually. Yes, we did. Yeah. This, this cat. Yeah, yeah. The, the, be the beautiful tent. Beautiful yeah. Hey, look at that I picture. He he recent, it was recent. All right, here, sing along with it, Antonella. Stay from the uh, ladies, la ladies and gentlemen, that was Antonella singing all. Why don't we hit pause on that thing uh, there, Sydney, so we can close out the show with that song. So, Antonella, we're, we're really lucky. When are you going back to Italy? Unfortunately, tomorrow. <laughs> no, I want to say I'm happy to be back to Italy, even though I'm going to miss a lot Los Angeles and America. Well, I, I look at you as my little Italian sister. Am I, am I still good with that, or what? Yeah, uh, so you're always my buddy, my brother. Okay, uh, okay. I, I guess you don't like incense. No, I'm just making mm -hmm. something up here. Wrong idea. So, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, if you're listening right now, tell your friends this is the show that will explain to you how the world really works. Because most people in this world are trying to tell you how the world should be. And if you're confused, one of these people don't know why bad things keep happening to you, call us when we're on the air, and I'll explain it. I can solve all the great mysteries of life, and now I have beautiful Antonella, and I also have Sydney. I got two of the most beautiful women on the planet sitting next to me. Yeah, but you better watch out because I think Antonella might spill me and take me to Rome. No, no, that, that would be my worst nightmare. Okay, great that would be, deal. That would be my worst nightmare. But so if, if, you, if you're riding around in your car, if you're on your iPad, and you cannot contact us right now because you don't want to take your hands off the steering wheel, send us an email. And we'll answer your questions on the air. It could be about anything, okay? Our email address is wildmanbillshow at yahoo.com. Then we have Sydney repeat it because okay. it sounds sexier when she says it's, it's going to. wildmanbillshow at yahoo.com. And you can also go to our forum and we have comments on our website. And I think somebody was taking a bunch of pictures in here, going to upload them to our website. So that'll be really nice. Yeah, yeah. And next week, I was going to have a theme for today's show. A person wrote to me and said, should I wait forever for the love of my life, or should I just settle for less and take the next woman that walks into my life? Now, if you're lonely, sometimes you might take the next man or woman who walks into your life, but then a year or two later, when they both start growing old and she starts looking kind of raunchy, you might say, oh, maybe I settle for less. Antonella, because you're here and I know you're not just pretty, but you're smart, should someone who has not found the love of their life, should they wait until that person walks into their life or should they settle for less and take the next person they sort of get along with? Mm -hmm. What would you do? It's a tricky situation. Yeah. <laughs> I would think about it. Okay. okay. On my way oh, back oh. to Italy. Well, what if that person that walks in your life has a, like, a whole trunk full of marital aids and you can make any part of your body really happy? Would that be a place? I, I, can I 
jump in here real go fast. Ahead, say, yeah, go ahead. What if there were then, you know, one love of her life? I mean, she met like a couple of guys. Well, yes. go ahead. Like just one. <laughs> yeah. More. You're talking my language. You're talking my language here. We are on the same page. Yes, you are. You betcha. You betcha. So anyway, I have beautiful Sydney here with me. And uh, she almost didn't make it to the studio. She had lost her phone, but... Oh my gosh, She's oh, my butt. it's been horrible. Yeah, I've been moving. I have no internet. I had no electricity. I have no fridge. I have no phone. But I made it here to the studio mm -hmm. today, everyone. And so. I, I give her high, high, uh, high, <laughs> high five for that because she's a trooper. But and now it, she has a friend more. Right now she met Antonella. Oh my gosh, right. it's so exciting! You have no idea how much I've wanted to go to Rome, how much I want to see the Vatican, how much I want to meet the Pope, and all of that kind of stuff. And also just taste that delicious Italian food because I swear to you, food tastes better in Europe. I know I don't know why. I think it's because they fertilize our stuff with such a beautiful area. Yeah. She, uh, I'm gonna introduce to her the Pope, but she's gonna introduce me Obama. Okay, <gasps> that is like a deal, okay. baby. <laughs> okay, now what about the Pope that's retiring? Uh, like, I have, I can read people, and I have a feeling that he's about gonna, the first day he's off the job, he's gonna buy like a red Corvette, maybe like a classic Corvette, get a brunette, and go for a ride. Do you, do you think that's possible, or is that a hallucination I got? <laughs> It's just an illusion. Okay, yeah. I think we've, we've hit a high point. And at least we learned something today. We learned the difference between Belladonna and Belladonna. Okay? So let's close out the show. Let's see if we can find Mr. Pavarotti again. Uh, is he still queued up on the CD yeah, there? Uh -huh, yep. All right, bring him up. And we're going to for all of you, go to our website. Send us email, Wild Man Bill Show. Go to, go to YouTube, Wild Man Bill Show, and make get our ratings up. All right, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. See you next time. What was the song you were just singing? Is that now? okay? Uh, what was Transportation and water. So do your part to help those in need by sending a donation. And here's how you can do your part. Big or small, every donation means something. Contact the American Red Cross Relief Fund. The phone number here is 1-800-486-4357. I'll repeat it again. I know some people have a delayed reaction. 1-800-486-4357. Or you could text Red Cross at... Nine zero nine nine nine, and and donate ten dollars, and it's a good. Call. Okay, are we going to the next commercial? Okay, mm -hmm. hit the button. Let's see what comes up. Okay, we doing good. Good. Yeah. All right, how's We're it? We're having it a lot of fun. Yeah. Oh, my radiator's playing. How are you holding up, Mary? Good. Okay, now pick out the last song we're gonna close with here. The last one. It could be this one. Mm -hmm. My sunshine. My sunshine? That sounds like a hillbilly 16, song. 16. 16. You're going to cue it up? Got it. 